Are you 18 to 25? This counts for you. Do you feel like you don't understand politics? If you get on Lahu, read, read the newspaper, watch the news, you learn a lot more than you think you, do, you would. You don't have to study politics 24-7 to understand the concept of voting. You, you don't think the vote will count. If if every person says the the, the vote don't, don't doesn't count, we have we want to have a half voters. Every vote counts in the elections. Most people spend millions of dollars on campaign. Some young people don't have the time to register or vote. Most things are local, but have lines or are a process. Young adults are seldom the focus of elections when they are the future of the country, but they are not being informed of all the issues and importance of voting. We could try to convince you that your vote is important, but do you really know how important it is? The president election of Kennedy and Nixon is a good example. The election was decided by Illinois with an average of only two voters per percent. This small percentage of voters gave Kennedy victory over his opponent and put him in office. My point is, if two voters per percent can help him get into office, your count could be the one that chooses your president for our country. We either think that <clears throat> both parties' delegates are corrupt, so what's the point of voting? Because voting is any type of election from local to nationwide. Any vote is important. Be the election for a governor, state official, legislator, or president, it is the it's the people of the nation who ha who has the right to put forward policies that will affect the town, your job, your country, through the government bodies. More than half of Americans under 29 picked Obama over John McCain, but it's been four years. Obama's historical campaign is becoming just that history. Campaigns feel they shouldn't waste resources targeting young adults. The young is our future. They should not be ignored. And everyone needs to vote. Governor Mitt Romney and President Barack Obama entered the closing with the campaign as an exceedingly narrow race, according to the latest poll by the New York Times.